Room inspection's almost over, and Matt and Zoe oh. have gone fully forensic. That's unforgivable. We can't have that. Today, Danny and Graham are poised for perfection. I just hope that Snahal delivers on standards today because the way he set himself up, I think I'm expecting the rips. Hello. Hello, good morning. Welcome to the Ladbrook Hotel. You'll be staying in one of our double rooms tonight. That's priced at £70 per night, including breakfast. Thank you very, much. very much. Looking forward to it. The room looks very smart and neatly presented. Looks up to date. It smells very fresh. Yeah, very fresh. Very clean. Nice and clean, yeah. Yeah, I think the room's been freshly decorated, but the carpet has been changed, therefore I can see paint stains on the carpet. Room inspection's nearly over. This one doesn't work. Exterminate. <laughs> Danny and Graham have lost their spark. This plug, it just comes off the wall. It's not even plugged in. No wonder it wasn't working. How are the facilities? Oh, four. Oh, that's not nice. Electrics in the room, not wired. The reason I know that this room was Danny and Graham, it's a model room that we've made. We haven't had time to wire the sockets or the lights. So my apologies on that. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Thanks Thank for you. a lovely Thank stay. You. Would you stay here again? No, not surprised. Hi, Pete. Hi. Good, Good to see you again. Thank you. See Caroline, you. lovely to see you again. Welcome to the beach house. Come on in. Thank you very Thank much. Thank you. OK, Carolyn, this is your room. The price is £90 per night, including a full English breakfast. Thank you very much. Thank well. you. Enjoy. Thank you. I think it's a bit small, isn't it? For yeah, it's a bit £90. Oh. With the host out of the way, the guests can see if the beach house will make waves in the competition. Comfortable? Oh, yeah, you, you sink in that one. Let's have a look at your pillar. Oh, dear. It's quite stained. Oh, dear. Oh, my God. £87 a night. You don't want that, do you? Room inspection's almost over. Liam and Karen aren't radiating positivity. Could do with a, a lick of paint. The whole thing needs doing. It looks like someone's vomited over it. How clean was the beach house? Been scored a three, which is quite disappointing. Disgusting radiator, dust everywhere. There's some rust on the radiator as well, but, you know, we're next to the sea, everything goes rusty here. Let's see if they're gonna stay again. And it's a no. I'm not entirely surprised. Hey, hi, guys, how's it going? Yeah, very good, how are you? Good morning. Yeah, good, thanks. Good. Well, welcome to the Holford Arms. Your room is £124 a night, and if you need anything, please let me know, all right? All right, lovely. Thank, Thank you very much. Thank you. Cheers, guys. Oh. oh, wow. Oh, this is lovely, this. Lacking these... the beams. Yeah, the beams are banging. With the hosts out of the way, the guests can get their hands on the Holford Arms. The bed's lovely. The bed is nice, nice. solid wood bed. Yeah, that's nice and clean. Look at that. Yep. Oh, no way. Oh, what? That's <laughs> filthy. There's a huge cobweb there. There's another cobweb up there. Yeah. There's also one on the lamp. In fact, there's two on the lamp. There's a hair. Oh, yeah. Oh, actually, there's a few more over there, look. There's a couple there. Yeah, and over there. Room inspection's almost over, and Matt and Zoe ah! have gone fully forensic. I think that's a toenail. <laughs> no, it's not. That's a toenail. Well, whatever it is, it maybe shouldn't be in the drawer. It's time to fill out the anonymous feedback forms. How clean was the Holford Arms? Cobwebs everywhere, just on the beams. Hairs on the bed, and then we have the toenail in the drawer. The drawer. That's unforgivable. We can't have that. How clean was the Holford Arms? We've got four. Not happy. Cobwebs everywhere. Their room was on the top floor. Maybe that's got more spiders. Yeah. Even so, cobwebs should be cleaned. Dust on beams. The building is 400 years old, so that's going to not help the dust situation, yeah. but not ideal, is it? Yeah. Hairs on bed. Pretty sure we, we checked the rooms and couldn't find anything, but maybe we should have done a. A closer inspection. Toenail in drawer, that's really disappointing. I'm looking forward to payment day to apologise because that, that shouldn't be there. The main problem I've got is that Matt and Zoe said they wouldn't stay her again. There's a few questions I want to get the answer to on payment day. Bring it on. Oh, very nice. It's military green, isn't it? Here we go. <laughs> Hi, Hello. I'm Justin. Hi, Justin. Hey, Justin. Mike. Hi. Mike. Nice, nice to meet you. Again. Welcome to the coachman. Let me show you to your room. Thank you. 
uh, £75 a night, and that includes breakfast. If you need anything, don't hesitate to give me a shout. Thank you very Thank much. You. All right. Basic. Very. With the hosts out of the way, the guests can take the coachman for a ride. Sofa in front of the TV. Oh. Suit you. Hey, nice comfy sofa. Oh, look, cobwebs there. Yeah, There's a bit. squash spider there. No way. That is pretty gross. Let's see what they thought. How clean was the coachman in? Four. Bit disappointing. Just in cobwebs everywhere. OK, that's surprising. He did thorough clean of the rooms prior. Squished spider on the wall. I have no idea how that might have been missed. Thank you, Justin. Thanks, mate. Lovely, enjoyed it. Are they going to be uh, coming back again? No. Bit disappointed, because there's certainly guests that I'd love to welcome back. Welcome to Montpellier Hotel. Come in. This is your room for the night. It's £65, including breakfast. Please have a lovely stay. Oh, thank thank you. you very much. With the hosts out of the way, the guests can have a rummage around their rooms. Staining on the carpet. Staining on the carpet. There are marks on the walls. There's a big stain on here. And one here. <laughs> and one there. Is that chewing gum, is it? Looks like chewing gum. Curtains hanging off. My pub's not working. Needs a bit of love, yeah. Room inspection's almost over, and Stuart and Fiona are blowing hot and cold. You want... Perhaps lost one of its... This, this can't be true. That no, really is, is not good. I think the bathroom is, is quite frankly, pretty appalling. The hot tap comes off on your hands, there are tiles missing, and all the dispensers is empty. I would say four. OK. Ooh, the bathtub fell off. Huh? And the bathtub fell off. <laughs> fall off. <laughs> Thank, Thank you. you. That's lovely. Would you stay here again? Let's find out then. Oh. No. 